Hey guys and welcome to your new video on this channel. I'm Sabi from Code Revolution. So today I will show you how to generate custom uh, post meta fields and custom post taxonomies for content that is generated by Crawlomatic or any other plugin that I created that supports this feature. So as an example, I will configure a rule and show you exactly how to do this. So I will import content from TechCrunch from this page and I will be using Crawlomatic because this is a great example plugin in which I can show this. So let's enter the start URL from which I wish to import content. So let's define also from where should the plugin import the content. So let's use the visual selector here and select the content of the post okay now if you go ahead and search for custom fields or custom taxonomies you will see that the plugin supports also adding this and let me show you both right now so this is the help which uh, describes how to use the custom taxonomy feature and custom field feature so you will have to know the slug of the custom field this is the id the textual id of the custom field and input it here and afterwards you will need to make an arrow like this and the value of the custom field the value can be something textual that you write that you hard code for each post or can be the short codes that you already might be familiar with so you can use this okay so let me show you exactly how this works okay so let's say i wish to create uh for post the custom field code revolution custom let's make the arrow with equals and greater sign and now let's enter some values for this custom field. Let's say the title is. And now let's use the short code for the post title, which is this item title. So this will be the short code for post title. So using this, we will get the code revolution custom. Uh, post uh, meta data with this value in it okay so let us get started and let me show you how to it looks like and it is running importing and let's check posts and this is the post generated five seconds ago by the plugin and if we scroll down here we will see code revolution custom the title is and the original title of the uh, post okay now let's go ahead and let me show you how to use this to generate multiple post uh, custom fields so to generate multiple post, post custom fields simply use a comma and copy paste the same thing and just edit the slug of the custom field, of the custom field yeah so let's enter here like this and here let's use another short code like item url which will input the uh, link of the post now let's save it let's delete the imported post and let's regenerate it let's re-import it now we should go back to posts and check the post again and now we have the code revolution custom and if we scroll down because these are ordered alphabetically also the test one will be visible here okay now let me go ahead and show you how to use the custom post taxonomies feature 
so if you search for taxonomies the thing will be similar also here however there is a difference between the post custom fields and post custom taxonomies feature because if you enter it like this if you copy from here and paste it here it will not work because taxonomies will be possible to be uh, assigned to posts only if you create them before assigning them from the plugin so custom fields will work will work also for non-existence logs and the plugin will be able to create the custom field however for custom taxonomies you should create only existing custom taxonomies you can create custom taxonomies for example with the cpt ui plugin with this you will be able to create custom taxonomies for posts and for custom post types i i created this this is assigned to posts and to pages this is a custom taxonomy using uh, created using this plugin and if we go to edit we will see that its slug is code revolution so this should be used in the slug section so let's enter code revolution this arrow and now let's enter for the taxonomy a value so awesome value so this is the value if you want to input multiple values for the custom taxonomy you should use the comma and input another value new value so this is how you should import multiple values for the same taxonomy now save settings let's delete the old post that was generated and let's rerun importing and if we refresh our post here and uh, go to here where we will see the custom taxonomies we will see the code revolution which has this plural name will have the awesome value and new value uh, assigned so like this you will be able to assign custom taxonomies to post if you want to assign multiple taxonomies you should use the semicolon here so this is the separator for multiple taxonomies please note that custom fields have the comma separator so this is uh, different so here this is a custom field value separated with comma from the second custom field value and here this is the first custom field value and separated by semicolon from the second custom field value which i need to create right now using cpt ui so second okay second and second so this will be the second custom field id we created and here simply you can increase the size of this enter second this must be the exact slug of the custom field you created so second and here you can enter a comma separated list of values to assign to the second and also don't forget you can use this short code so let's say item title let's assign the item title and item URL to the second custom uh, custom taxonomy. Okay, now let's save settings, delete the post, rerun it, and now we should have also the custom taxonomies assigned to the post. Okay, and if we check here, we will see that Code Revolution has the taxonomy assigned and we should also see the second taxonomy which is somewhere here I need to search for it okay it is not showing oh here it is 
I think I created the wrong yeah sorry so let me create it one more time because I created the custom post type and not custom taxonomies so sorry I create it right now so second okay and assign to posts and second is already just re registered oh yeah bear with me guys i am deleting now the custom post type that i created so i messed things here up because i created a custom post type and not a custom taxonomy type uh, and i need to delete the second custom post type and go to uh, edit taxonomies and here enter second and second and assign to posts and add taxonomy it does not work for some seconds okay sorry guys i should be ready in a second in a second okay and now it worked so now let's go and edit the second which is now seconds because the second was not good enough for some reason let's delete the old posts let's rerun importing and now we will have two taxonomies for generated posts and each will have the correct values hopefully so let's check this and here's the first taxonomy and here's the second which has the correct thing now okay so yeah this is all for now i hope you enjoyed this content and you learned how to assign custom fields and custom taxonomies to posts using crawlomatic or any other plugin made by me that supports this feature and yeah until next time please subscribe to this channel it is really really appreciated and stay awesome have a great day bye bye